trucks. Without them, food would neither get to the consumers, products to the customers, nor production material to the factories. They reach even the remotest of places and are crucial to our modern logistics. Despite the rise in freight rates, there is an increasing pressure to reduce costs. Trucks therefore need to run for as long as possible and, above all, without any interruptions. In Germany alone, for example, they cover distances of about 70 billion kilometers each year. Fuel consumption is key in this overall scenario. The power cell unit, or PCU, which consists of the piston, piston pin, piston rings and cylinder liners, makes a substantial contribution in this area. But how do these components cope with the truck's continuous load? This was investigated by Mala with the help of a truck that already had 1.2 million kilometers on the clock. We were able to largely strip and thus look inside the engine. This gave us an opportunity to examine the Mala components in detail after the long running time. We thus found out that the condition of the PCU, the components that you see here, almost corresponded to their original conditions as delivered. This result shows how perfectly the individual components are coordinated. It's a direct result of Mala's systems approach. With holistic systems optimization, we carry out our analysis according to functional aspects, such as we look at friction, consumption and wear and tear across all components. We can thus achieve a 3% reduction in consumption which, in turn, results in an efficiency increase of the same value. 1.2 million kilometers, that's almost 30 times around the Earth. The Mala PCU has undergone half a billion ignition cycles and its pistons have traveled approximately 370,000 kilometers and with virtually no signs of wear. However, Mala continues to work on improving these reliable endurance runners. We want to ensure that truck engines run even more reliably in the future, require less fuel and are less harmful to the environment. We are well on track to achieve this with our systems approach.